With the support of our partners, CVC is creating the Credit Valley Trail, a 100-kilometer continuous trail along the Credit River, from Port Credit, Mississauga, to Island Lake Conservation Area in Orangeville. Led by the trail's indigenous partners, the vision includes constructing seven indigenous placemaking sites along the route. These sites will be symbolic spaces, represented by several Anishinaabe dotems to celebrate indigenous culture on the Credit River. Building placemaking sites creates unique spaces for trail users to deepen their understanding and appreciation for indigenous knowledge, heritage, and culture. Bonjour, Bogage Gay Higanin Indigenous Cars, Magazine of Dodan, Mr. Saga and Dal, New Credit, Dunje. Namkage win, Wasa Kabinja Bomb, Gwinishki Bobby Goom, Kadea Kazim Wadak, We the Bim Shanam, We Dope Nishnam, Asia Beja Go, Bakadain, Asia Beja Go, and Nim. In the beginning of time, the Anishinaabe used to live beside the Great Salt Sea. The crane was the leader and the caller. With his loud voice, he was called the Busani, echo makers. Next came the bear, who was the army. And with the wolf pack, the police, they kept order. Next came the turtle. And the turtle was hospitalization. They were our healers and our medicine people. The next one was the Martin, who was the head of all of the life givers, the hunter, so that we didn't overhunt or overfish. And lastly was the fish. And the fish were our teachers. And it is from here that the story and the law of the fish come. In the beginning, the pike and the sturgeon lost their balance and they started killing all of the other fish. They didn't care, care where, young ones, old ones, little ones. They called upon the creator, the rest of the fish. And so the creator cut the head of the pike off and he took one bone from the sturgeon. And with these, he made a teaching tool on how we should look after the environment. The Credit River watershed supports remarkably diverse fish communities. Over 75 species can be found in the watershed and the surrounding areas of Lake Ontario including brook trout, red side dace, smallmouth bass, and northern pike. The Credit Valley Trail will be a 100 kilometer continuous river valley trail from the headwaters of the Credit in Orangeville to the mouth in Mississauga. It will connect people from nearby communities to the wild natural beauty of the Credit River, providing countless opportunities to appreciate the diverse fish communities found right in their own backyard. Our wild fish species need clean water and they're affected by what happens on the surrounding land. Populations of our most sensitive fish species are declining. Cold water fish like our wild brook trout need clean cold water to sustain themselves. Groundwater springs and shade from trees help to keep trout waters cool even in the hottest summer months. But climate change threatens these species with warming streams and changes to stream flow. Dams and other barriers prevent fish from moving to refuge areas where the water is cooler. Together with our partners, we work to restore habitats and reconnect our rivers and streams. An important part of the Credit Valley Trail is securing and protecting natural lands in perpetuity, ensuring a healthier Credit River and fish communities, now and for future generations. As we continue to connect the Credit Valley Trail and build these incredible indigenous cultural sites, 
we hope you'll take part in supporting this journey.